So tonight we're going to do a little different of a photo duel. Ted kind of challenged the community, at least those who are wanting to explore um, expanding their photographic horizons to do a little bit of a, sh uh, a theme and variation type shoot. So what that means, I guess, basically is to pick a, pick a subject and shoot it 10 ways, 10 different ways. Um, I'm really excited about this. I feel like myself as a photographer, sometimes I feel like I shot whatever I shot and uh, it was pretty good and I'm ready to go to the next thing. Uh, I, I need to learn a little bit more patience and I think this will help. So I'm super excited about this challenge. I think it was a great idea for the community. Good job, Ted. What you eating today? Tomato soup burned my tongue. And now I'm gonna have some salad to cool it down. No, you know, it's funny how it's funny how many vloggers eat on camera that I watch. A lot of them actually eat on camera while they talk even. Mm -hmm. But I did it once and I was I was like lambasted for it. Mm -hmm. So many people were like, how dare you? All right, well, we're here and we chose a place this time. It's a little shopping center area. It's got some art pieces by an artist, uh, a sculptor and painter that I like, James C. Christensen. He does a lot of fantasy stuff. So I'm hoping Am we I can- in the background of this? No, you are now though. Oh, I keep going. Carry on. Yep. So I'm hoping we'll get, uh, well, I'm hoping that Danae will choose some of that art for me to photograph. So we may not have like as many unique things and we may have some really bad shots. We're giving ourselves the freedom to have bad shots. I'll probably show you them all just so that you can kind of see what the experience is like, just in rapid succession. And then maybe at the end of the vlog, we'll show you our favorites of the bunch. And just like normal, you can still vote for who you think it did a better job. I think the last one, Danae is one winning right now. But yeah, Danae is winning in the polls. So, so congrats to Danae. Did I say I was gonna win that night? I always say I'm gonna win that. Yeah, night, you always so. say that. <laughs> you ready yet? Almost. How's that salad coming? Really good. She doesn't want me to point the camera at her while she eats. I don't know why. So we're gonna shoot with the X-T2 like we do a lot of times, but this time we've had a lot of people ask for our thoughts on the 27 millimeter 2.8, which I love this lens, but we haven't had a chance to really focus on it. And Danae's never shot with it. So tonight we're just gonna use this. We're just gonna swap back and forth and do our shots with it. Uh, it's not a low light monster and it is low light. The sun just went over the horizon, but we will be shooting in high ISOs. For that reason, we're also going to shoot in black and white. We're going to use the Acros uh, preset, which I am a huge fan of. So, be looking for some good contrast. And again, 10 different shots of the same subject, theme and variation. So, here we go. We're going to pick the subjects for each other. So, it's going to make it extra hard. But I think I already know what I want Danae to shoot. And no, it's not them. Although, I do like the bunny ears. I think this flame thing would be pretty cool. I like the legs. That's a nice stance. That's the power stance. <laughs> Ice cream cone, fire, kind of ironic. Last shot. We're gonna put the ice cream cone in the fire. We're gonna choose for Andrew. You're pointing the camera at me, so is it selfies? I'll take 10 <laughs> selfies. Sounds good. Andrew, I want you to do the carousel. Okay. It gives you lots of really cool options. Okay, all right. We might let you go. This is a hard one, because I'm shooting through the glass. 
Man, this is hard. I'm gonna see if they'll let me shoot the carousel inside. Okay. They might not let us film inside, but we'll see. Yeah, I just asked him if we could so we're not, get some shots. We're not trespassing then? The key is to not ask the manager, it's to ask the 16 year old. And by the way, we're shooting on the, we're shooting on phones now because our, <laughs> my 6D uh, ran out of batteries. I think you would have done a better job with this than me. Well, in the light that is re remaining to us, I am choosing this skylight for Danae to shoot. How do you feel about that? Really good about it. Got a nice soft glow from your oh. illuminating from your phone. Kind of thinking now. <laughs> <laughs> the obvious shot first. Andrew, this is like let's do like a two shots to be had here. Let's do one of those. Hey, you know what? Cinematic. I gave you a really good thing. What? To shoot, and you gave me this. Hey, you know what? Two this. And I'm done that is that. what the challenge is about. Stretching you. Two shots. You got eight more. What? What is this like yoga now? I don't know what to do. <laughs> I'm giving her hints now. We're cheating. Oh, yeah, that's what I was saying. Look that way. What's the idea with this one? Today? I have no idea. <laughs> I'm getting desperate. Help me. People are all looking at us like, what are they shooting? What are they nothing taking? See, folks. What are nothing they taking pictures of them for? Seriously, nothing to see. We're from the structural integrity department. pictures of these statues now or Andrew is this is what I want Andrew to shoot this cool statue and this is what I was saying this is by that artist I really like James yeah. C. Christensen really awesome I just wish there was some light make it happen Andrew Branch you're not supposed to tell anyone our last name why just kidding <laughs> I thought you were serious ooh I like that Little peasant lady with the fish. Oh, I do that all the time. What's that called? Blimping? It's called chimping. Ch <laughs> chimping. Blimping. Make up another word. For this. <laughs> this is art and it's meant to be appreciated. Yeah, but is this part of the art? It, I think it's supposed to probably have water in it. Hey, I'm sure it is. That it's, has some spider webs on it though. It's really cool with the light behind it's it. It's strained. We should have brought a flash. At least some kind of light. Look at the way he's holding the fish. Let's explore that. Why are you getting a phone? So he get a good shot. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna hold it super, super still. And I'm gonna shoot on 14 frames a second. Hear that? Yeah, I heard it. That's the sound of a good 14 camera. 14 frames a second. Electronic shutter with 15. Shutter speed. <laughs> Maybe one of them won't be blurry. Maybe one of them won't be blurry. I like it up and those clouds in the sky. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, 
7, 8, 9, 10. There's a lot here. There is a lot here. When I finally figured out the best way to shoot it yeah. in this low of light. And I got that. <laughs> it's a challenge. Well, I wanted you to get good pictures, not necessarily. Right, I'll pick something cool. Okay. Yeah, phone booth, Danae. Oh, you're excited about that? Yeah. Okay. I hate that shutter sound. I know. Should I put it back in a me mechanical shutter? Huh. That's an interesting stance. <laughs> That could be like the, the cover of the... You're so mean. Hey, so I have chosen this, and he cannot, he cannot touch it. Too bad I don't have a macro lens. Yeah. I had this register when I was a little girl. I'm obsessed. This is the murder scene. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's terrible. You shouldn't be laughing about that. I know. Now then, a count of ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's ten. So the conclusions are what? The lens. We like the lens. I like the lens. Yeah. And I mean, we won't know for sure until we get it into post and look at the shots but yeah the lens was pretty good um what do we like about it i like the focal length i like what you get when you look through the camera i like how little it is plus the tension with because of the size of the lens yeah we got maybe 50 percent less weird looks than we would have otherwise in that store i think because of the size so as far as the shoot itself um well what do you think good. I felt like I had harder things to work with. I definitely gave her harder harder things to shoot, I'm not gonna lie. I gave him things I would love to shoot. Well, I gave you things I would love to shoot. They just weren't as easy, I think. Yeah. And they weren't maybe, yeah, they weren't as obvious. They're harder to shoot. So when you vote, vote according to what, take into account what the photographer had to work with. Yeah, I think that's fair. I'd say, I'd say vote for how we did with the shot we were given, since we had no choice over that. And we look forward to hearing what you think. That's it, thanks.